Hey everybody, Danny here, and uh, so today I am uh, sharing with you a really cool tool that I came across probably mid -la mid last year, and this tool was just in beta. Um, actually, no, it's been about a year. So uh, this tool is called Designer with two R's, and uh, what what it does is it, it creates eBooks for you. Okay, so and that's very uh, kind of a a, a vague statement but let me let me drill down a little bit further so what it does and what it doesn't do so what it doesn't do is it doesn't write the content for you right so you've got to have that uh that yourself but what it does do is some pretty cool things um what it what it does is it repurposes your content so if you have a blog uh, and you have articles that you already have on your website you can quickly uh very quickly create an ebook uh, maybe used for a lead gener as a lead generation tool or create like that you can actually have on your site and and someone opts in, opts in and downloads it uh, and you get their email address or you can publish it on the Amazon Kindle store uh, you know on on, on uh, iBooks or you know any other uh, digital publishing platform okay so what I'm just going to show you today is uh, I'm really getting just getting back into this and so I'm going to document sort of the process of how I am uh, getting my first designer uh, designed ebook onto the Kindle store uh, to use as a lead generation tool. And so what you can see here is I'm in the designer dashboard and I've got, um, you know, I've already uh, kind of imported some of this content and I did this about a year ago. Um, but uh, it's time to revisit it and actually finish the project. So what it what it does is uh, you've got you know your cover your cover here. They have some stock photos you can put in the background if you want to want to get something out there fast. Um, if you have your own images, you can you can upload those um, by using the image uploader. Uh, but I'm going to scroll down and show you so what once you get your content in here so what, what like each of these was actually a uh, not necessarily a blog post this is actually protected content that I had uh, on my membership site um, at the time and uh, so one thing I was able to do is make that public first and foremost so that I could scrape it and uh, basically take the URL that I was looking to uh, pull all of the content from and paste it in here um, just by using the uh, the importer for designer so I'm not going to dive into that right now I just want to kind of show you uh, what it what it can do and so it, it took all of the content that I had from the pages that I specified and imported these on pages in the designer canvas so uh, what does it do it means that like I'm actually able to speed up the production process. Now, obviously, you know, I probably just don't want to hit publish and use all that content. I might want to go back and, and tailor it right uh, just so it has the right look and feel, but also the text uh, and context of the text is correct as well. All right, so uh, so that's, you know, you can see I've, I had a, a five-day challenge um, a couple years back uh, for being more focused and productive, and uh, I took that content and created a PDF of that. So I'm going to work uh, on this and uh, and share share with you along the way uh, some of the things, um, some of the benefits, uh, some of the the pros, cons, um, misfires that I might have when I'm trying to do this. Uh, but I'm really you know just looking to you know number one uh, leverage the Kindle platform. I've I've used Kindle uh, and published books on Kindle uh, for for about five four or five years right now. And um, you know I've made had great success in the niche, niche publishing world. However, uh, I've kind of put that on the back burner, and really my focus is, and you know no pun intended, but my focus is to really uh, niche down on my personal branding and use this as a lead generation tool for my personal brand. And so, if you're looking to do something similar, um, then I highly encourage you to just stick stick with me. Uh, you know, follow along and uh, and take action if you are considering. Uh, you know, it, like who? So who's this for, right? Like, you know, it's anyone who's trying to do to build a personal brand. 
if you're trying to, whether it's sell ebooks or whether it's to create courses or, you know, coaching or whatever it might be, if you're looking to get, if you're looking to be in the digital space and to increase your email list and your leads and ultimately over time your, your, your profit, then this is a great um, strategy that a lot of people are using. Um, and uh, I've used four niche books to build email lists, but now uh, we'll be using it to build my own uh, personal brand list. So anyway, I hope this, uh, this video kind of uh, inspires you to, um, to look into um, self-publishing as a uh, way to not only build your email list, but to generate that, uh, that authority, that know, like, and trust factor with your audience. So, uh, so stick with me on the ride. And uh, if there's anything in particular that you, uh, if you're if you're if you're following along, if there's anything in particular uh, about this um, kind of behind the scenes uh, journey that I'm going to take you on, uh, go ahead and leave it in the comments below, and I'll uh, make sure to address uh, any of those as we move forward. So anyway, have a great day. I hope this video uh, helps you get inspired. It's inspiring me uh, to get back and focused to building my brand. And I hope it does for you as well. So I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Now, if I can only like turn the camera off because uh, using, yeah. Or maybe my, my computer will just decide to freeze. That, that that's what it's doing okay am i there yet are we there yet there we are finish